Beginning recording in three, two, one. <laughs> hey everybody, Sojin here, back again with Cammy. Hello! Literally right before we started recording as I was counting three, two, one for our recording, she just belched. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna keep that in the recording or not. Three, two, one! <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're playing some more Drill Dozer. Yay! And, uh, so the last one we were at the Sculptor Factory, next one is the Art Museum. I'm Ooh. sure my friend Daniel would be proud. I- I am proud. Yeah. <laughs> I love how every time you think Art Museum, your mind immediately goes to Daniel instead of me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Daniel's a friend of mine, I've known him since middle school, and for some reason every time we hang out, he always wants to be basic and just go to an uh, art museum. no, not basic, he's classy. Excuse fine, you. fine, basic, classy ho, that's what he is. He's not basic, he's bougie. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he drinks a drink called kombucha, which I have to say it's a good drink. Yeah. <laughs> So I've been rewatching these episodes, and I've noticed I've been using the word like a lot, and Sojin is getting very frustrated and having to <laughs> edit it out and censor me. So I'm going to be implementing the like challenge. The like challenge. Like, every time she says the word like, please tell us in the comment below. I, In fact, it, it'll take a bit longer to edit this, but I might just put a counter. <laughs> I don't know. I think that'll be dumb. I mean, so here's the thing. <clears throat> Using like for its intended purpose, that is fine. Mm -hmm. That is like, that's okay. That That is not counted. But if I say like excessively, that is when you count it. Yeah, it was a bit much. I had to mute some of it. Uh, uh-oh. I guess we got trick-or-treaters. We don't have candy. Oh. You want to answer that? Uh, not now. Sorry, we don't have any candy. It's okay. Hi, happy Halloween. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like the kids are just at the freaking door knocking, going, "Hey, open up! Give me all your candy, punk!" Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> happy Halloween. I I bet by the time we post this, it's gonna be well no, into no. November. <laughs> yeah, we're 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 posting this. Or we're making this during Halloween, but I'm probably not gonna upload this for a while. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe like a week and a half from now. <laughs> anyway. Ugh, right. So we are implementing the like challenge. If I say like excessively, not in the way for its intended purpose, mm -hmm. it's gonna go up on the counter. Okay. Boss, can you hear me? It, it looks like you're winning inside. Our stolen red diamond was taken to the museum. Let's get it back. Okay. I love the Art Deco lines in yeah. the, the Art Museum. Yeah, the Art Museum level is really cool. <laughs> it's funny because I, I was just recently doing a lot of backtracking in this level on the Game Boy Advance on my own save file. Mm -hmm. Also, I'm like failing hard right now. <laughs> just falling all over the place. <laughs> Yeah, these are supposed to be like newer type of clowns or whatever. Oh, did you did you say like un unnecessarily? Shut, shut up! <laughs> shut up! That red tube up ahead is part of the museum's air conditioning system. It's ribbed for her pleasure. No, no. <laughs> air ducts make for perfect sneaky entry points for thieves like us. <laughs> Just drill into the duck screws to spin through them. Yeah. Like my dad. Shut up. Keep in mind that you gotta drill the other direction in blue ducks. Yeah. Oh, so okay. you, just, you just go through it. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. It's, a, it's a ribbed red condom. Uh, <laughs> it's gross. It, it, it's sriracha flavored. Ew! <laughs> no! And the blue one's peppermint. Oh god. Those sound both horrible. Oh, there you go, a peppermint. But yeah, uh, just just keep in mind, like yeah, that the, you have to press L for this one because it's reverse. Mm -hmm. If you do R, it won't work. Also, my drill bit is not upgraded yet. I can't break that. No. Die, fire hydrant. <laughs> die, mermaid. No. Die, thingy, die, not mermaid. Not the mermaid. <laughs> that 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 pains my soul right there. <laughs> She's obsessed with mermaids. If you guys didn't know. <laughs> Well, it's this the Little Mermaid was my jammy jam. Have you seen Splash? Uh, yeah. Years ago. We need to get Splash. 
Do we have Splash on DVD? Because if we do, we're watching. No, we don't have it on DVD. Well, my my mom has it in her place. I I didn't see it. Okay, so. but yeah, I think that might be our our Halloween movie night right there. Because uh, Sojin's not a fan of horror movies, even though I am. Mm. But uh, so we have a compromise regarding horror movies. So mm. you know, if, if it is more of a psychological thing, then you know, usually he can handle it. But he has to space it apart because mm. he gets nightmares, which is fair. Because I mean, like when you're an adult. Oh. There it is, number one like. Uh. <laughs> I just caught myself. Because, as you know, when you're an adult and you get nightmares, it impedes your sleep. And when you have to go to work the next morning, that is no bueno. And, uh, it's like I'm a lightweight when it comes to horror movies. It just depends on what it is. Like I can watch The Grudge and laugh at that all day. Yeah, because it's more stylized, uh, mm. you know, because it... Uh, it's based on Japanese cinema. Yeah. 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 Sometimes, you know, when movies like yeah. another night break, <laughs> we're, we're two on the counter. Uh -huh. Because sometimes, regarding another uh, I'm gonna country this, I'm gonna cinema, this, I'm gonna steal this paint. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's the Thomas Crown affair. Have you seen that movie? No. It's it's a very adult movie. My mom watched it because she was uh, enamored with Pierce Brosnan, the you know James mm -hmm. Bond. He used to be James Bond, by the way. But he was, I think he was the one right before Daniel Craig. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, so she's totally like enamored and in love with Pierce Brosnan, and uh, she found that movie with Rene Rousseau, and it's about. Pierce Brosnan playing a thief, an art mm -hmm. thief, and Rene Russo is uh, the police chief or whatever, like a detective. No, actually, no, she's not really with the police. She's with the insurance company. Okay. And she's in charge of the investigations and whatnot in order to like look into what he's doing. And so like they they're always like on him, but he's kind of like Luke on the third. Like mm -hmm. you know he's guilty, but he's so good at covering up his tracks. Okay. So it's just one of those movies, and it's, it, it is I just amazing. wrecked their shit in like a second. <laughs> and then the, the, the soundtrack in the movie, it has music by Sting. Yeah. Cool. It's just one of those like boomer movies that is still enjoyable. You're a boomer movie. I'm kidding. Gee, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only messing with you. Also, these are annoying. So you gotta wait. Mm -hmm. There you go. Wait. There you go. Alright, are you on your phone? Well, because someone messaged me. Who messaged you? My friend Tracy! <laughs> Tell Tracy I'm busy! Okay, I'm messing with you. She just sent me a video. Okay. <laughs> There's no, uh, emergency. Mm -hmm. See that weird looking lift in front of you? That's called a lateral lift. To latch onto it, just drill it from either side. <laughs> Yeah. Press left or right on the... <laughs> uh, on the D-pad. <laughs> I was just like, I literally looked at that <laughs> symbol and I'm like, the Swiss flag! Oh, <laughs> Press left or right on the Swiss flag, control pad to switch sides as you hang on. Keep drilling and, s and swap sides to avoid hitting your head. Also, don't be racist like him. <laughs> How is it racist? I'm just messing around. <laughs> Pointing out the flag of Switzerland is racist. Yep, so this is how that thing works. It's like, you, uh, hold on. You're gonna you attach drill on, on one both side, sides. and then yeah. you have to use a D pad to switch. And then, oh, so in and the then middle, you, okay. yeah. In the middle of going up, mm -hmm. switch. that's awesome. You just have to keep pressing and holding R, though, or else you'll, like. This fall. game, like, can. So, number three. <laughs> Like, 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 Shut like, up. like, 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 and subscribe. Yes. <laughs> this game continues to, like, uh, and they, again, continues to amaze me. I'm trying very hard. Don't worry, I, I used to be, I, I, my word, my overused word, I used to say actually and, uh, <laughs> and, and obviously. And literally. Literally. And, uh, there, I, I forget what other word. Yeah, that reminds me of, um... Dark Gear! 
That reminds me of uh, the show Hot Date, where uh, Bridget. <laughs> there, there's a character on that show named Bridget, and she's like every mo millennial that is very hi uh, not hipster, but like very basic mm -hmm. and very Instagram centric. And so she she's like always attached with a man, like always has like a, a side piece, and then like but she's also no. the worst girlfriend ever. So yeah, like whenever like that boyfriend is not like participating in her Instagram stories or whatever, she's like, I will literally actually leave you. Yeah, those, those were those were funny. Like I, I like that they were all small like little skits. Yeah, it, it's literally a skit show, you know, mm -hmm. but it's with the same two actors in like different costumes. Yeah, and and it's funny because some of them I some of them I literally had to look at them a second time and be like, it, it's really them. I know <laughs> the makeup can be pretty good. Damn it! I really wish I had that drill bit. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. If you guys haven't seen Hot Date, check it out on Netflix. Mm. It's with em Emily Axford and uh, Brian Murphy. Mm. They were also in the show Adam Ruins Everything. If you guys haven't seen Adam Ruins Everything, it's also on Netflix, and it's a great show. It's honestly Bill Nye the Science Guy meets a campy, like sort of zanier comedy sketch sort of thing. Yeah. It's it's very educational and what's great is that even when they mess up on their like sources, they yeah. are very good about correcting themselves. Yeah. Motherfuckers, I'm gonna kick your ass with my drill. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I'm a fan of that purple wallpaper on the left. With the, the triangles. Yeah. Like, Why do you keep picking them up and then moving them? Because you have to, it's a part of the puzzle. Oh really? Yeah, you pick it up, put it there. That's adorable. Bam. Yeah. I'm not stealing paint. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just moving. moving. Yeah. Can you imagine going to like an actual art museum? Yeah. And just moving paintings around with the wrong like uh the plaques or whatever. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Mona Lisa's now the screen. <laughs> like the, the the guys at the art museum be like, not again. <laughs> well, Why? Which intern has been getting into the one? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Is it wine or champagne? I think they serve champagne during like I think like it's those. champagne. Yeah. All right. So yeah, they've been getting into the champagne. Mm-hmm. All I need is some champagne right now. Mm-hmm. Freaking robo doggo. Drill your bubble! Oh my Like they didn't have to go through enough during the vet you know, vet exams. <laughs> I mean We should title this episode mm. like Art Gallery Switcheroo or Art Gallery Feng Shui. <laughs> I think Art Gallery Feng Shui is funny. I remember I learned about Feng Shui when I was like a teenager. Mm -hmm another one on the list. I don't know how, mm -hmm. how many this is already. I don't know either. <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna probably be in a much better uh, state of knowing how many when you're editing. Probably. Anyway, I remember learning about feng shui when I was a teenager and uh, I remember using it in a sentence when I was around my dad because he's like, why aren't you like, why is your bed why mm -hmm. is your bedroom like this way? And then I'm like, oh, I didn't like the feng shui. And mm -hmm. he's like, the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> where go, where go, boss? It's hooey. Hooey, whatever. Hooey! Wow, the police sure make their robots on the cheap. That one was held together by just one screw. Like my dad. <laughs> I was gonna say the same thing. <laughs> Remove it, and the whole thing falls to pieces. Like my dad! <laughs> This is this is stuff. No, I'm just gonna hide. <laughs> I'm just gonna hide in here. Yeah. All right, that's the end of this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Please go ahead <laughs> and then hit that subscribe she button. She looks like she's she's rocking out. Yeah. Like, no, no, no. The way you tilt her back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just add some death metal music. Oh wow. <laughs> I feel like they need to put music like that in art museums more often. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> all right well thank you guys for watching thumbs up the video if you like it subscribe and comment let us know uh, if you have any suggestions and go ahead and make sure you check out the next episode when it comes out all right <laughs> <laughs> Peace. See you guys. Bye bye. Bye bye.